Our research began with a very simple question. How do calling relate to employee performance? First, let's define calling. Calling is a line of occupation that someone feels destined to feel. We were interested in answering this question because individuals are increasingly searching for their calling to be happy in their jobs and find the meaningfulness in their lives. However, it is not clear whether this sense of calling makes them superior performer in the workplace or that the devotion of the work makes them difficult for their employers to manage. For example, a maverick like Mr. Kitty in the movie Dead Poets Society. So we conducted three survey studies among employees of a nonprofit, a church, as well as employees from a for-profit organizations such as bankers, engineers, and healthcare professionals. And the findings were exactly the same across three studies. People who feel called to their job tend to be better performers than who are not, and critically will dedicate themselves to help the organization reach its goals. So what we found most interesting is the implication of calling for the employee-employer relationship. Calling-oriented employees tend to value their ability to exemplify a calling in their daily work activities. And they like likely to view their organization as instrumental in achieving their valued goals associated with their callings. And that is how they develop the emotional attachment to their organization. And it's that attachment that ultimately binds the calling to high quality work performance. For employers, it is important to state clearly the organization's values so that employees with a calling will be able to readily identify the degree to which the organization's values are congruent with their own. For employees who feel called to their job, it is important to find a company that meets their ideological expectations and that allows for acting consistently with those values. Otherwise, their work performance may suffer.